All right, just a quick update to my ball python collection. I've added another rack so I can have some more snakes, and I've added two new snakes to my collection since my last update. All right, so residing in my rack is one of the snakes I have added to my collection. And here I have a pie bulb. The snake is a male, a normal pie bulb. Very excited to add one of these to my collection. I've always wanted a pie bulb. Let me go ahead and pick them up. Oop, a little, a little scared. You can get a good look at him here. He's a handsome guy. He's got a lot of white. He's got you know, some pattern left. A little black spot there. But he's very handsome. And I've always wanted the, one of these, so it's a real treat to just have one. Let me go ahead and stick him back in his enclosure. And we'll go ahead and move on from him, and I'll show you the second snake I've added. All right, so let me go ahead and get out the second snake I've added to my collection since my last update. I have him off in the juvenile rack, also for quarantine purposes, before I add him to my main rack here. But this is a super lesser pastel, possible vanilla. And take a look at this snake. He's, he's a gorgeous snake. I got him so I could pair him to my Mojave spider female. So you can get all kinds of crazy combinations out of that. But I'm just, I'm real excited to have this snake now. I, I picked him up just a couple weeks ago at Repticon in Baltimore. He's doing really well. He's already eating thawed rodents. So hopefully within the next year or two, he'll be big enough to breed, as well as the female I plan to pair him with. All right, so that's it since my last update, just two new ball pythons. So be sure to stay tuned for more videos here in the future and check out my channel. And hopefully I'll be starting with my never ending herping series season two very soon.